my name is Todd Bowlesby and I'm a solution architect for Armonino. Today, we're going to review a feature called Collaborate, which is part of the core financial management software within Sage Intact. Here we have a bills analysis report and Joanna, my finance manager, is going to look at this report. She sees a bill here for Bank of America for the long-term note payable and says, geez, this is really a lot higher than uh, payments in the past. So she drills down in to the bill itself from her dashboard, looks around, maybe looks at the attachment, doesn't see the answer. So here at the bottom, she sees that she's got Sage Intact Collaborate. Now Collaborate is, think of social media built into the software. It's really uh, on every transaction and every master record. So she can either drop a post, a file, or a link here. So she says, hey, at Todd Bowlesby, just like you would do in something like LinkedIn or Twitter, why is this payment so much higher than previous ones for this line of credit? Todd gets a notification based upon his preferences, in this case an email, clicks on the email, comes here to the transaction and says, oh, Joanna, it's higher because it was the last payment. I've attached the payment schedule for your review. So you can see here that Todd has attached this payment schedule, which in this case happens to be an Excel spreadsheet, but can be any electronically stored file. In addition to that, underneath the More Actions button here, you can also see we can upload uh, new versions. So you can have kind of living documents within the system. This is particularly useful on things like projects. And people can follow those documents so that based upon their preferences, they will get notifications when new versions are uploaded. In addition to following those uh, file uploads, people can also follow the conversation, whether it's taking place on a transaction or within a, on a master record. Back at the dashboard here, we see that we've got other components that kind of turn on when you uh, implement Collaborate. One of them is the company feed. So here I'm seeing all the conversations that are taking place throughout my company. Over here we see the to me feed. So anything that's been addressed directly to me, I can see here in this feed. Over here, it's the what I follow feed. And that's anything that I've clicked that follow link on will show up in that component. And then finally, Collaborate allows you to create your own groups. They can be either pu public or private. And if it's a private group um, and you try to add it to your dashboard, then it'll say that it's a private group. You're not a member currently. And instead of the share button, it'll give you an ask to join button, which will email or notify the uh, administrator that you want to become part of that group and they can decide to let you in. And then the last piece about Collaborate here is when you are doing a post, you can do a snapshot of a, a component off of your dashboard. So in this case, I see a number of charts and graphs. Um, here's this report. So maybe I select that report here. Now it's taking a snapshot of that report, placing it into my feed here, my post. Now, in addition to this, what's really nice is I can hit the edit button and I can enlarge this or make it smaller and I can also mark it up. So for example, maybe I want to have an arrow that's pointing to a specific area and maybe even emphasize that with um, a circle or a square uh, and then save those changes back. And that allows us to have much more meaningful and contextual conversations in our post. So this has been a quick overview of the Collaborate feature within Sage Intact. Hope you've enjoyed it and have a great day.